yourself? My name is Alexandria Brock. I'm 17 years old. I am the daughter of Brian and Michelle Brock. I'm the youngest of my two siblings, my older brother being 18, and my older sister being 24, an Alpha Kappa Alpha soror sorority member, and a graduate of Morgan State University. Um, I am a junior at Limbo Math and Science Academy, where I have attended since 8th grade. And I went there from 8th grade to freshman year. However, I left sophomore year to go to the Chicago High School for the Arts, also known as Shy Arts for their theater program. However, I transferred back to Lindblom junior year this year um, because Lindblom is just where my heart is. Um, and I plan on graduating from there, so go Eagles. I'm a lifelong member of Chosen Tabernacle Ministries, where Walter and Sandra Gillespie are my pastors on the south side of Chicago. I am a participant of the YMCA's Metropolitan Chicago's Black and Latino Achievers Program, also known as the Achievers Program. Um, and I am also an ambassador for their Teen Leadership Institute. Um, I've also interned with the YMCA's Metropolitan Chicago's Marketing and Communications Department um, because I plan on majoring and making that my career. My hopes are to go to the East Coast um, and possibly attend NYU, New York University. However, I'm also looking at schools in the Chicagoland area like Columbia. I'm currently an intern with the University of Chicago's digital storytelling program where I am a youth advisor. I'm also um, a rotational correspondent and co-host with Teen Talk Radio Theater, which broadcasts live, live out of the University of Chicago's radio station, WHPK 88.5 FM. I have been a part of the ACADES mentoring program with Lambda Alpha Omega for two to three years. However, I transferred to Theta Omega's mentoring, mentoring program, um, Team Pearls, because it's in my community and it was just easier to commute. What is Miss Fashionetta? Miss Fashionetta is basically a cotillion. However, it's also a fundraiser where all the proceeds made go towards giving out college scholarships to high school juniors and seniors that they've helped transition from high school to college and beyond. Who produces this event? Miss Fashionetta is produced by the Accolade Foundation Incorporated, which is a branch off of the Lambda Alpha Omega chapter of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. How did you become involved? As I previously mentioned, I was a part of Lambda Alpha Omega's mentoring program, Akadets, for two to three years. And in that time, I was a hostess for Miss Fashionetta for two years. Um, and ever since then, seeing how everything came together, and I've just been awaiting my chance to actually become a debutante. Describe the event. Um, Miss Fashionetta takes place in a grand ballroom. It is a black tie event, um, so the girls are in 
ballroom gowns and the guys are in tuxedos. It is a full course meal um, and the girls are presented by their fathers. Uh, they are told, the guests are told about their academic achievements, their social achievements, and then they curtsy. Um, throughout the event, there are multiple dance routines between the debutantes, the escorts, and the parents of the debutantes. And then at the event, the winning debutante, who is going to be crowned Miss Fashion Nebula 2014, is crowned. Tell us about the scholarships provided through this event. Um, all the proceeds raised from Miss Fashionetta go towards providing college scholarships to high school juniors and seniors. Um, it's just another avenue to ensure that these young people go to college, have money for school. Why do you want to be crowned Miss Fashionetta? I want to be crowned Miss Fashionetta because Miss Fashionetta is a role model. And on top of that, she is an extension of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority. Um, and, Alpha, and their values are very much grounded in community service. And I'm very aware that the year that Miss Fashionetta is crowned, 2014, the whole year she has responsibilities. And I feel like I will represent the organization very well. Um, I feel like I embody who Miss Fashionetta was intended to be. How will it help you grow as a woman? Well, whether I win or lose, though I really do want to win, um, the process of going through the workshops, um, like etiquette and finance and um, interview tips, just things like that are going to help me grow and better myself as a woman. But I feel that if I win Miss Fashionetta, I can take and implement those skills into my duties. What does it take for you to win? The debutante who raises the most money is the one who is crowned Miss Fashionetta of 2014. How can friends and family help? Um, friends, family, anybody can help by buying a ticket to the event or buying a page um, for in the ad book to promote their businesses. Um, or they can do, or they can pass on the information to solicit sales on my behalf um, to raise money as well. Um, or they can just buy a raffle ticket or make donations. Do you believe you can win? Yes, I do believe I can win, but not without the help of my family and friends and you and the people that you know. I thank you in advance for your support. Latino Achievers is a program for all students, not just black and Latino, 
to come and have fun with new friends while at the same time figuring out and setting down the fundamentals of our future. It helps us figure out what we want to do as a career, not just a job, and it gives us the confidence, knowledge, and connections to get there. The Teen Leadership Institute is a kind of branch off to these ideas, except it's in a more intimate setting where the group leaders can really focus on each individual and more concisely help them on a better level of becoming a profound leader. Both programs have helped me come out of myself and experience things that I otherwise would not have. I am a better public speaker and leader than I was before the Teen Leadership Institute, and I have a better understanding of what I want to do because of the Black Latino Achievers. Like our t-shirts say, I know what I'll be in five years. I have written a poem called My Provincial Life, and this I hope to show the importance of these programs in a world. My Provincial Life. These provincial mindsets everyone seems to have is going to be the death of me. Is limiting the space we have to, some, to make something more of everything. Thinking is going to be a no-go because of all the blocks in the road. At heart, I am a road runner. Ideas used to run out of my mouth and down my tongue like butter. But the sluggish that hit, hit the youngsters always makes me wonder, is this all to my provincial life? Going outside and seeing gangs getting into fights over property that's not even theirs? It's not like they don't have the opportunities. It's like they see the stairs, but since they need repairs, they choose to harass their own communities. I'm not going to go into the cliche things that everyone tweets, but what's up with this? It seems so fictitious. Girls acting narcissistic, boys being unambitious. I just don't understand. Is this what God had planned for my provincial life? No, I will not take that without a fight. Pressure, temptation, isolation, aggravation. These are all the things that led me to my self-determination. But first I have to get a visualization of my revelation that gave me rejuvenation to get my education. But I couldn't do this in isolation. No. First I have to find a congregation that can help me in my exploration of reaching my future destination. This is why I give glorification to this organization. The Black and Latino Achievers, or BLA for short, has given me and many other teens the manifestation of wanting to create our own motivations and not limitations. BLA has given me and many other teens the visualization of our revelation so we could become motivated in reaching our destination. See, every creation wants to run this nation, but the filtration of our country's foundation refuses to allow our generation to run this nation. Not because of deprivation of information, but because our generation is in a damn nation. Hardly any have had a, ha have had a high school education, let alone college graduation. Thanks to VLA, I have no limitations. I have many motivations. I just need concentration. I don't need your confirmation. My occupation will be running this nation. Thank you.